Joined with head men's basketball coach Mike Schauer after his team's 75-74 victory over Baldwin Wallace in the championship game of the Lee Fund Classic. Coach, really a great game all night. Never any bigger than a six-point lead either way and, and one that your team just happened to pull out in the end. Yeah, obviously thrilled. Baldwin Wallace is a fantastic team, well coached, and it was, you know, it uh, was kind of a heavyweight fight all night. Both teams, uh, you know, kind of landing haymakers, if you will, and, and uh, big play after big play, kids hitting big shots, and was really pleased with our team's ability to persevere. You know, we had a couple really bad possessions offensively late in the game, and when Baldwin Wallace scored to go up by two, uh, and we had the timeout, and uh, ran a play that we actually haven't run before. It's sort of a, a, a small nuance of a, of a play we do run, but a small change to it to create a situation where Ricky would be in the post with a pass from Aston. So they couldn't help, but I was thrilled that Aston executed it perfectly, and, and obviously what a weekend Ricky had. Getting tournament MVP honors, 29 points tonight after 34 the other night. Uh, 10 of 11 from three. It's, it's hard to almost put into context how good he was this weekend. It really is. I don't know that I could describe it. I mean, if you look at the numbers, they, they speak for themselves. And if you saw it, he was pretty special. And, and really, uh, tonight carried us at times offensively in the first half. Where we're, you know, if we were struggling with foul trouble and really had a, a lineup on the floor that was struggling offensively. And he made quite a few plays to kind of keep us, keep us close and in the game. And I was actually pretty thrilled that we went into halftime tied, um, given the foul trouble we had experienced in the first half. And you know, he was pretty special, and, and obviously, um, you know, any mention of, of the Lee Fund Classic without simply acknowledging Coach Fund, and I tell people all the time, I was fortunate to know the five men that preceded me in this job, and the truth be told, those of us who came after Coach Fund, I think we kind of feel like we're sort of holding his spot, uh, that he's the coach of, of Wheaton basketball, and he was a friend and a mentor, and uh, so much more than a successful basketball coach or a successful baseball coach, he impacted the lives of men. There really aren't very many Wheat basketball uh, alums um, who haven't been impacted by him in, in one way or another. And so the fact that we've now won eight of nine, uh, in my, won eight championships in my nine years here, means a lot to me as the head coach at Wheaton.